Hey, hello guys, this is my project for CS50 crossword and I'm gonna show you first how my program works uh, let's see in this case I'm going to yes, to run structure 2 and words 2 um, let's try it again there you go and here I have the output of my image from here and sometimes like it uh, doesn't generate a solution because it's very random the what what uh, words it takes so yeah so this one this was for sorry this was for the structure 2 and words 2 now i'm going to check for um let's see the next one uh 1 1 is words 1 structure one there you go I have this output also um, now let's check for the next one um, this is gonna be let's let me see this is gonna be for uh, zero one uh, words one and structure zero there I have this output mm -hmm. and for my other structure zero word zero let's do it there we can run it and I have this so this was um, the testing for my code and I'm gonna show you very quickly um, my code, what I did here in force known consistency. Um, yeah, so basically, um, I get I go for each crossword variable, then I do the revise function uh, that it makes R consistent with variable uh, Y. Um, yeah, this is my this is my algorithm AC three. As you can see, you can pause it and check it. Um, yeah, assign complete, consistent, and order domain values. Oh wait, we have more a little bit here. Let me, so here we have, select unsigned variables, backtrack, and that's it for today. So I hope it helped you and see you next time.